Good morning. This is Takeout Tuesday. Uh, you can see I'm Pastor Rick and I'm in the sanctuary. I really like this angle from the altar. And again, reading from Bonhoeffer's book, Life Together. I hope this is, um, you know, week after week as we read out of this little classic, uh, that it might encourage you to buy this and put this in your own spiritual uh, library. One of the things my mom and I, when she was still alive, uh, would always debate about was the importance of absolution and confession, not just at the beginning of a worship service, which she questioned, uh, but also at the beginning and end of each and every day. And Bonhoeffer writes uh, in this little classic about the importance of thinking of, about ourselves in a humble or meek manner. And he talks here about the ministry of meekness. He says, only he or she who lives by the forgiveness of sin in Jesus Christ will rightly think humbly or meekly of him or herself. He will know that his own wisdom reached the end of its tether when Jesus forgave him. And I wanna repeat that again, because this is why we begin each and every day with repentance and forgiveness, why we start each service with absolution and confession because of what Bonhoeffer says here. Only the person who lives by the forgiveness of, of sin in Jesus Christ will rightly think of themselves in a humble or meek manner. They will know that their own wisdom reached the end of its tether when Jesus forgave them. This person will be ready then to consider the neighbor's will more important and urgent than their own. What does it matter if our own plans are frustrating? Is it not better to serve our neighbor than to have our own way? And so this morning, our prayer is that we all discover meekness, humility, and that we begin, if we haven't done it already, always to practice forgiveness, repentance, and absolution, God's forgiveness, reminding us that we've forgiven Jesus each and every morning, and each and every evening, it's a great way to start and end the day. And that we keep that status, that attitude of humbleness and meekness in our hearts. Blessings to you today. Bye-bye now.